let me start out tonight's message by saying that the Democrats want the invisible wall to be made out of steel. Yes, fellow Americans, invisible steel. That's huge, tremendous. Thank you all, former presidents of the United States. God willing, your wishes will be granted. Let me also point out that the invisible steel wall is invisible. No one can prove that it does not exist, or indeed, that it is not invisible. The invisible steel wall has great spiritual power. We know this because it is capable of being invisible and steel at the same time. Like all great leaps of logic, oh this is great, the invisible steel wall is based upon both logic and faith. Tremendous. We have faith that it is invisible. We logically know that it will remain invisible because we can't see it, even if we built it higher and longer. In the beginning, God the Father created the heavens and the earth, the United States of America and Mexico, and the spirit of the invisible steel wall was hovering over the waters between the two countries. Oh, the great God, the Father said, let there be light, and there was light. The Father saw that the light was good, and he separated the light from the darkness. Of course, the light shone upon America, and the darkness remained in the shadows over Mexico. It's common sense, my fellow Americans. Choose good over evil. God the Father now makes a request of all Americans. To all you patriots out there, send in five dollars to my special fund at Trump Towers and make God the Father happy by helping to build the invisible steel wall that we so desperately need. Good night from the Oval Office, and God bless America.